are spirit beings. We are spirit beings. We have systems. Our faith is not about you know systems. We choose structures. Our well, faith is not providing in those, those structures. <laughs> we want strategy sessions to help our operation, but we don't put our faith in those strategy sessions. Because we know mostly, in most cases, those things are in the mental realm. And the mind does not have what it takes. To hold our life together, especially to give us the mind loan. If you want to blow mind, then you can't depend on mind power. Because I know if I start asking each of the pastors here, if there's anything, almost everybody will say is how do we take the financial of the church to the True of us. True. You want the financial of your church to go to the next time start. You know, you need more resources. Stand up because you know you need more resources. So, everybody stood up. Sit down. Go to the next level. Please be taught by maintaining the proper accounting system, which you should maintain. But it's not by that command. In fact, in most cases, what I want to do for you is that. Say, you see your balance sheets. I say, oh wow, this is good. But I'm not giving one more than good results. You want a real apostle. Let me share this with you. Thank God it's not around like I'm fully sharing. Two about two years ago, shall I came to see me? I want to do more. The finances around, I think that time they were like maybe 300, yeah, about half a million a year. I know, a month. I said, no, bad, but before we can do all of And he said, that was what we You know, wisdom tells you always ask questions. Yeah. What did I say? Well, Wisdom tells you always ask questions, the right questions. Because there are certain things I know that the only way to pull it out of me is by asking questions. Because I can't teach you everything I know. It's not because I don't like you. Well, I don't want you to know you. Wait, this is not impossible. It's impossible. But you now have to ask me what is important. So he asked me that question. I, will, I can't even remember whether it yes, it was on phone. He asked first of all, then maybe the next time I now came to the country. I think I think I will get more most of information to to my So I said so. I said, shall I want to go to the next place? Yes, that you want to go to the next one. He said the way to the to the next one. So every pastor here will be that percent that some of us are, at times we see it as Jews. Mm-hmm. Our faith is not even involved in it. It's like, okay, ah, they say we should send 10 percent to you. No faith. <laughs> it's just, it's like, it's very times. <laughs> Some of you, you feel like maybe the guy who gave us bricks or bricks or some bricks. <laughs> so we have a lot to do. And let me tell you something. Pastors make that mistake globally. It's not just you. Pastors have a view of like, ah, this will protect the finance. This idea should be like, it's not my job to protect God's money. <laughs> Rather, it's my job to make sure God's money is spent the way it's meant to be spent. It's not your money. It is his money, and he's the one that gives directives on how it will be what spent. And let me tell you this: I don't even want the next level because I want the next level. If you want the next level, Gabriel, your years must be developed. Lord, what will you have us to do? 
first of all, in giving, and secondly, in projects. Yeah. There are certain levels you will not attain until you move by faith into certain projects. It's a law. And here you are, you are using your finished mind to, to, to balance accounts. And God is saying, this is next. I hope I'm talking to somebody. Yes, sir. Because this is not just ministry money, even your personal life. God is saying, this is next. And your mind is like, ah, we're not yet here. Yeah. So I told him, I said, listen, you want to move to the next level? It's easy. But number one, you're giving culture must change. Say, you know what we can do? In giving to your next level rather than balancing your accounts. Okay, okay, let's balance it. Later. Sure. You want mind blowing results? It's going to take some mind blowing giving. It's going to take. Could it be some of us as pastors and the reason why some of people, some people that ought to be in the best and the best? Because we are continuing there. One of the things I told you in that conversation is this. It's not the size of your church that determines how much money you have to use. The churches that have numbers, in terms of counting, ah, 5,000 okay. people. The people came for the money did not come. They are too defensive. As some of us, you know what I'm talking about. Mm. Some of you have noticed that there were seasons. Really, in the very bad days, nothing much happened. But your finances were almost doubling. All of you have noticed that. And you are like, you are wondering, ah, who gave this money? But it's not like we grew now, very quickly. But the money grew. In fact, I've seen cases whereby the number grew and the money reduced. <laughs> and nothing can be more frustrating than that. Because you have more people to minister to with less money to do it. Spiritual intelligence. Spiritual intelligence. Spiritual intelligence. So you don't know your systems, including your financial system. With your mind power. We need the education of how to maintain a proper accounting balance. Am I right? Yes, sir. But we don't let you know there's a way certain information you have read you now begin to cover your life. Okay, 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 okay. Like even when that you are supposed to be. What if God says this month? Empty your account. You are my buddy in Chicago. Remember the testimony one of the pastors gave? Reading pastors. I talked about when they were when they needed their building projects, how we brought money to them. It was not just reading the building for we for several churches. So the time we were doing it was we didn't have a building. We didn't have a what? The kind of money that if you mention it, you like, ah, should you know the money you should be saving for your down payments? So be squeezed it. Take this money to them. Uh, Shekinah glory. Take this money to them. Uh, uh, Jesus out. Take this money to them. When you see certain results, you can go to Chicago now and see a church almost spanning the streets. And that's what most pastors will do foolishly to me. Say, oh, yeah. well, that, but there's something they are not telling us. They tell us. And they're not looking for spiritual truth. Oh. They, want us to, they want me to say, ah, we invested in this, in this amount. Because they're like, so they want some tangible strategies that they can 
take back to their church so that they too can buy his sweets. And listen, I just make those not work like that. Though. I can tell you, we did this investment, we bought this, we bought it. But there, there were things that parted us. Mm. There were seeds that parted us. Mm. That did not just happen. To so glory God, I have a church member that joined the church two and a half months, two and a half years ago. That as of the time she joined the church, she was only making about two and one thousand five hundred a month. Today, he makes six figures a month. Fine, she just come in yesterday. Just started a new line of business. Just yesterday, it was the last place that she went to the first place. And this is the No, one thousand five hundred a month. Spiritual intelligence, 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 spiritual intelligence. To the glory of God, we spend hundreds of thousands on legacy, the legacy of already. And it's like we have not spent anything in the last one. At least that's where your account is. Because the account is not small, it's even bigger. And there's no crazy fundraising. No, no creative fundraising. If I'm concerned my body, I fought with them because they wanted to take some money out of church accounts. I don't know. I should just tell you. By the way, I want to appreciate everyone of you for what you did with the Lord. Amen. Amen. Your reward will always. Amen. 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 So back to the first I have to do that. So what to the first time I have to do that? Because the answer is too much. You know, it's too good for me to release money from my own body. But people that know me, you know, I'm that, I'm that, I'm that. I'm that. I should use my own body. You know, it's been so so good. I'm not going to say anything like that. I'm not going to say anything like that. If you look at that account, it's too good. Like, because I was like, they're doing this project, they're doing that project. But it was down, it went up. I don't even know who's giving. <laughs> you know, initially you want to calculate. After a while, you just give up. No, there's no point. It's okay. So the money is there. There was a particular weekend I will never forget. You know, you know one of those weekends as a pastor that there are so many announcements. And you made the announcement and you forgot. <laughs> Offering. Mm. So class me say, ah, 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 we have not given. Oh, please, you know what? Uh, if you have not given, just give oh, they will put the post and they walk to me. And the next thing the accounting department send you, they give you for the weekend, you can see for five thousand. Ah. <laughs> if you like, collect three of freeze. Money, afternoon, evening. Money, afternoon, evening. The people will just divide. They already know you are coming for their offering oh, three times. So it's okay. <laughs> they will apportion it. <laughs> According to the original plan, they had. So there's no, there's no skill to collect it. Money is a hassle. And I can say to an extent, God has left you. 
but just a ministry in personal finances. And it's not because I live in America, it's because I understand some of these things. They have my house, my present house at Tiergat is not a dime came from America. I just I should have to work transfer dollar. And as of the time I started that project, I think I have five million in my house. And I was not in Nigeria teaching. So it should be like from Nigeria was coming. Oh. But what is your side of this that happens? Look at my September when I will be reading to pay me that. Yes, sir. So what do the question actually? I know it's all of you want to know the question. The answer. Without much numerical things, I literally watch their finances because it was a very special message. I literally watch their finances to all from that place. <coughs> that within one, two months, what was coming in a month became what was coming in a month. To a point now that weekly, the name get the wrong, spent one million in operation. That's not talking about the decade, and that's not talking about that. And I'm using this as a example to communicate something. But until we go to that place whereby he realized, okay. I need to take my mind on finances and be deliberate about giving. Not just giving by the rule of any pass. Because I'm speaking this by the spirit of God. Some of us, the moment you have done any pass, you are like, okay. The meters that you are even giving, your faith is what's in box. It was deuce. <laughs> okay, the meters that some of you think that Apostolish must spend back on you. Hmm. Some of us might not say that when I think we say, ah, there's no money. Maybe the money is in Apostolic now. Can Apostolic do this for us? Spiritual intelligence. Spiritual intelligence. Spiritual intelligence. Two things. Firstly, giving. Secondly, projects. You know, there are projects that God will bring to you as a church to stretch you. Your mind gets involved. Ah, no, we are not ready. Listen, listen, you will never be ready. <laughs> Nothing contains one that was the mind. We just put you in the box. We are not ready. No, we are ready. We will know. What makes you ready is when God speaks. God says, it is now. The difference between people that lives, that takes and leaves and goes away, and the people that are is their ability to give as ever commands 
Write it down. Give as heaven commands. Give as heaven commands. Give as heaven commands. Give as heaven commands. To the glory of God, I can say I'm a, gener- I'm a general in the body of Christ when it comes to finances. So I have the right to talk. Do I have the right to talk about it? Yes, so sir. Give as heaven commands. Give as heaven commands. Write it down. Train your heart to receive instruction where giving is concerned, personally and as an organization. Do you know if I missed the opportunity of giving 100,000 when the apostolic place started, I mean, the project started four years ago? If I missed that opportunity, I want to wear out financially. I saw the realm of the scriptures, and I see it is like a river flowing. Hallelujah. I receive that. I receive that. Rivers. Rivers. I see you coming into the season of abundance. Amen. Massive abundance. Amen. Amen. See your personal account and your church account, and you will lose it to tears. Amen. I receive that. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Next level. Rivers flowing. Rivers flowing. Rivers flowing. Rivers flowing. Rivers flowing. Rivers flowing. You know, just one and a half weeks ago, I gave so much in this country. In this country, I gave so much. My account, I was, you know, my mind was screaming that your account. The account went to a place that's never been to. <laughs> when you start seeing 200,000. <laughs> and I'm talking about how many, how many, like two weeks ago. No, that same account, without transferring any money from any day, reads 11 million. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. That's the word. Accounts. Without having to say, okay, move money from America. Hey, reach level windows. Just crazy like that. And I just see this in my life like that. Just catch me. I think a cafe had a I came into the country uh, two weeks ago and you know I felt I needed to come by here and so I took this trip. So I said, take this trip to my mama's place. So I was at my mama's place and there's this lady that was my new place for me to go. You know, for the last four years, she's been telling me, I want to get back here, I want to get back here. So the first thing I said when I saw it, I said, I'm going to do my own. She said, no, no. So what kind of everlasting relationship is it? She said, no, 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 Mary. That's how it goes. God has called me to a season of paying people's budgets. What is the cost? Because he's about to do some amazing things for me. Mm. We need me to pay people's budgets. Mm-hmm. 
Yes, sir. Uh, because what it brings my heart that you see my children not walking in what I'm walking in. Hello? Yes, Nothing. You will have quarrel with some people in your system in recent times concerning the use of juicy, whatever. When I was stopped, I was mad. I had to talk to Harry, Harry stop this nonsense. There's a reason I was the one that told Lucy to come here. He was looking for a place to be using what I told him. And what I saw in my heart was like the hack of the coming and being taken to the house of the So when Battery come back to me and said, Okay, we all are in here, they should be 500,000 a week. I said, Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Uh, that you don't understand is because we are trying to, uh, uh, we are, you know, all the accounting jargons. Uh, we have to pay. I say it's a see. If I got to a point, I told him, say I will pay it. I know where it's coming from, but it's a greater place. I have to, he will tell you, I say I will pay it if it comes to it. Because what I saw in the spirit is. The act of the covenant coming to the house of the Lord, and everything changed. Mm. And you are there trying to balance accounts. I think we just give up. Now, you know, there are so many things we pay for. You don't even know where God wants to take you to. You are balancing accounting. God is saying, make it a seed. You have to say, you have to make sure that's all. The question is, do you want a passive harvest? Yes. Or do you want this to just be dropping? Go, go, go. To, to, there are laws governing this. What did I say? There are laws governing this. 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 Hallelujah. Look at my life. My life does not make sense. My impact on this nation. Are you listening to me? I'm going to tell you what I saw in the realm of the spirit. God forbid that my status apostolically in this nation go to the next level and you as a local judges my first point in terms of apostolic expression you are not here God forbid are you listening to me? yes sir God forbid and this has been the upgrade of so many organizations from the Methodist to the Baptist, to the Episcopal, all of them at one point or the other, they were in the center of the move of God, including for squad. So after a while, you know, there's a spirit of tradition that develops with age. <laughs> with some form of spiritual pride. You have an idea. And your mind begins to run what God should be running. To become mentally aware and spiritually intelligent by the virtue of experience. No, we have experience. Which experience? You are no longer a child that God can tell, empty your account. Because you are now you are an adult that knows how to what? The Bible says the kingdom of God is like what? A child. When God says, you mean you want I have no beautiful adults that can argue with God. So, but I think we should organize this and put this in place. 
Even your ability to walk by feet is now impaired. Those who are so bad now. There's mental intelligence, there's emotional intelligence, but the greatest form of intelligence is spiritual. Spiritual what? Intelligence. intelligence. Which is the expression of your human spirit. Qualities. Innate quality of, of your spirit as expressed in thoughts, actions, and attitudes. Should I find it again? Spiritual intelligence is what? The expression of your what? Innate qualities of what you are called your spirit. In what? Thoughts, attitudes, and what? Actions. Expressions from the deep. Motivated from death of your spirit beyond what you can find. For example, as I was preparing for this morning meeting, at some point I just noticed I was almost blank. But having worked with God for a long time, I know it's okay. Could it be because God wants me to see the things that he has made for me? Mm. So I just go. Mm. Are you getting my point? Mm. Just go there. Mm. When you mm. get there, I will fill your mouth. You open your mouth and I will speak to you. Yeah. So you will literally prophesy. Yeah. You are, you are struggling with your points. Man, I have to be a better actor. Two. How to increase your leadership. Because since all those points are good, but that's not where my bread is on. Ladies and gentlemen, we've come this far by spiritual intelligence as well. True or false? True. True or false? True. When the news started four years ago, how many people did it make sense to raise up your hands? Don't lie off. Most of us, including me, we are still figuring how it will work. Did it work or not? It did. Come on, talk to me. Did it work it or did. not? Yes, sir. Did it work or not? It did, sir. After a year of expression, the law started putting on my heart. They will need to move out of Paris soon. I remember I went, you know, it was, I myself, I came and said, Shona, let's go. We went to what we were there. Plan. Not grandio. Yeah, the 58. And we want to talk today. You know, it was like when I was just being moved with it. And as of the time I was talking, you know, I know that they were putting us in the account. They were probably making like 300, 400 thousand a month. <laughs> and we were talking to Yard. But I was just being moved. Do you know the grandio idea? It was the last meeting, last visit I made. After I did next conference there, I said, I said, I said, by the time I came back from my party, it was so big. So I told Shala, get me the number of the party. Two days before I left the conference, I said, Is it not a reality today? Yes. Come on, is it not a reality today? Yes, sir. Is it not a reality today? It is, sir. What did I say? Certain things is not by it's calculation. Not by calculation. It's not by what? 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 Calculation. It's by moving in the spirit, operating by the power of your spirit. When pandemic broke, the people that were cautious talking about ministry, they shrank. Up to today, they are still strong. And the people that lived, they shown. Just a few people knew about Jerry said before pandemic. That was the number one. When you are talking about a ministry that has followership globally, it's number one in the world. Not in Nigeria. Life prayer. 400,000 by the time you sum up all the platforms. Life. I'm not talking about after you are sprayed. People now go back. That 
that's when some people went into black church and thought they were acting like never broke as much. What he could not do before pandemic, he started doing when pandemic. <laughs> That went into caution that their mind started controlling the able to be careful, cover your own soul, cover this. What is the setting they have? People are saying, cover your own I'm not saying that those should not be covered. What is deeper? What God wants to do? We've come this far by the Spirit, the way forward is by the Spirit. I see multiplication of churches. Amen. I see, Amen. I see a season coming that Carrie said that we just be, oh, where do we used to be? Amen. Amen. The reason why I'm saying this is, is God told me to tell you as a church. He said, we need to leave maintainers mode. Because we are in the maintainers mode, we are maintaining. What am I saying? We are maintaining. You know that maintenance mode, and it's like what is it now? Pick up whatever. We are trying to balance. I'm going to say, I need you to, to die for it. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is that clear? Yes, sir. I need the speed of no flow from the leadership. The, the, the people in the views, they don't I mean, they don't catch it. Have I communicated the act of God this morning? Yes, sir. Did you get something? Did yes, sir. Work? So I use personal life experience and I use what? <laughs> Spiritual intelligence. I'm going to be sharing much more in the general sessions. Is that clear? Yes, yes sir. sir. I pray for every of my and I pray that your light shine your heart. I pray that wherever your mind is distracted, derailed, disconnected, let there be a restoration. Amen. Amen. I pray for capacity to see like you. Amen. To run like you. Amen. Amen. To move like you. Amen. Amen. To give us your commands. Amen. Amen. I declare it breaking out out of the mold. Amen. Amen. To do new things. Amen. Amen. To pioneer new things. Amen. Amen. To do signs and wonders. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Let the spirit of faith fill this atmosphere. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. So we're going to have a place for the workers congress, right? Yes, sir. I hope your people are going to be here, your workers, because we need to dive into the mess. Are we ready? Yes, sir. I said, are we ready? Yes, sir. Because I'm not ready to be dragging anybody. Dive. What did I say? Diving. What did I say? Diving. Diving. What did I say? Diving. Diving. One of the things we need to have spiritual intelligence for is to think beyond your local assembly. What did I say? To so think beyond your local assembly. Your local assembly is a full of a apostolic seat. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. And today you see yourself disconnected. Just carry that look. That's the day you begin to, to see yourself limited. And pastors have that tendency to want to protect their fold. Your fold is a product of a higher place. That higher place perfect in this relation. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, there, there's one thing God put in my heart. Yesterday, I'm going to be. There are a lot of things I was handling to an essay that was the system dependent on me until now. That the God, God is telling me going forward, I will have to let it go. I was talking to Nana yesterday. He said, The reason why it seems 
will not be able to get much out of me regarding vision. The last few years, of course, it's no longer my duty. When I laid hands on you two years ago, there was a transfer. If I don't have the capacity again, I don't have it. But that's giving me some new capacities. Concerning that capacity, it's not your faculty, not my faculty. You go and plan what you see. Your body that is getting you frustrated concerning me. I'm not the problem. It's because you think I should be the one leading. When you should be the one leading, it's like me trying to lead the Kedja down. And there are churches like that, too. That is still the Jew that will be dictating their service. This is what you see. This is the song you should sing in this service. If I get into that, I will be free. Because that left me since 1999. I said, okay, I made the apostle by the operation, but just the apostle. God will give us help to structure the board that will work with you in terms of even Pastor T will not be able to help you because he won't see it. Because you are supposed to see it. You see it. There will be a board that will work with you. And you will find that and create a financial structure to support the operation. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I see a sea of sin coming into the season. God only says that apostolic season. Different people we have apostolic responsibilities. Amen. So rather than getting frustrated that they are not doing anything, you are the one that's supposed to be doing it. Maybe what the apostle there is supposed to be doing is just releasing God on you, praying for you, laying hands on you, and you want him to now be seen for you. And it's all like that is and you are now comparing one organization whose pattern is different from our pattern. Mm -hmm. yeah, but this is the way they are doing this. If anybody try that again, <laughs> you bring one strange fire from somewhere and you expect me to run a system that God has given us by that. I will, I will physically abuse you. <laughs> <laughs> because I will be so disappointed. I told them in Escalatia, I said, every assignment has its DNA. God is too creative to start duplicating. Mm. There's never been someone that God called that God told you, go and see all that, the way God has been. And you build like that. Give every one of them a specific pattern to build up that. The pattern of this ministry, by now, everybody should realize this strange pattern. How do you start a church in Lagos and under two years of operation? God says you are done. The bunch of 20 something. How many people are even married there? Actually, the table was married. You know that married person? No, no. they married no. after. They married after. They were a bunch of singles. Singles that were sporty. <laughs> <laughs> The natural life is like, oh, we need to build this to a point. Let them be set to Then you move. <laughs> because if you are done. But that was the thing that we do the next place and place there. I don't want to do what I'm not going to do. So don't mm -hmm. kill me. One of these things that creates sense is when you begin to hard things that God has removed as your assignment. It's like, I mean, I'm here. And I'm still planning for Chicago how they should be running their services. It can't work. People in the work here have not even finished it. I'm not being the one. People not even be able to get there. People go like, I don't want to work. I get there. And I go to the house and I say, okay, let me see what I can have to do after this. I'm going to do it. I seized the pastor a long time ago. I'm going to do it. Let me just do what I'm going to do. Yes, sir. Everybody, are we clear? Yes, sir. Are we very, very clear? Yes, sir. Now, is it so clear? Yes, sir. It's okay. Mm. It's okay. Yes, sir. It's almost twelve. That's a lot. After the general meeting, my first team meets. Okay. Are you listening to me? Yes, yes sir. Why is not necessary? I feel the session. Is it clear? Yes, sir. Don't do it out of the sea. Some of you have not even said I think they have to be this year. That's <laughs> the this. Came to the country, only a few people said, welcome daddy. 
I'm not even asking to come to my house. I'm not asking none of you to come to the house. But well, it shows your level of disconnection. It shows you are not even carrying in your heart. What you are carrying is the work you are doing. And you justify it. Not very, very easy. This is what they gave us. The work that is connected to the source. I wish this thing was running once we were happy forever. You can say for as long as I have this time, I have a responsibility to remind you over and over. You are losing it. Catch yourself. Hello? Hi, sir. Hello? Hi, sir. Are we clear? Yes, sir.